In this video, I'm going to show you how you can locally install supposedly world's best open source 7 billion model OpenChat. OpenChat was released a few days ago and has already shown quite a lot of promise. OpenChat, the company behind it, has said that it is introducing world's best open source 7 billion large language model which is OpenChat 3.5.1210 and it has already surpassed ChatGPT and Grok models. Before I show you the installation, let me give you a quick overview of this model. They already had released OpenChat 3.5 few days back prior to this one, and but this upgrade to the widely adopted OpenChat is mainly focused on increasing the performance in one of the most important areas for large language models, and that is coding. They have achieved a near 15 point increase on human eval while maintaining or improving performance on other benchmarks, making OpenChat 3.51210 one of the most capable generalist models to date. The model is also available on Hugging Face as you can see on this uh, Hugging Face page and you can also do inference a lot of other ways. If you look at the files and version, the model size is quite decent to around, I would say, 15 gig, as you can see these safe tensor files. Now, there are a lot of other details around these, and um, they also have a hosted demo at openchat.team. Let me see if I could quickly open that and show you. So, if you go to openchat.team, this is the chatbot UI which you can use today in order to talk with it. And you can select from here so this is already selected and then you can um, start typing your responses for example my line is king of jungle and then you can see the speed is quite good and inference is um, very nice but as you can see that um, king of jungle with the term originated and all that stuff and then a very very comprehensive answer it has given us all of the features anyway now another good thing about is that it is being touted as a replacement of chat gpt but in a 7 billion model but i have felt in few of the experiments that it lags a bit when compared to chat gpt but still a very good performance in most of the use cases now let me show you the installation the tool which I'm going to use for this installation is called as LM Studio. If you're not aware of what LM Studio is, that LM Studio, uh, I have done another video and I'll drop the link in video's description where you can find more. But LM Studio is a very simple tool to download and run your large language models. In order to use it, launch it on your Windows system as I have done here. Then on the home page, just type open chat and then press enter. It is going to show you all of the options here. There are a lot of people who have created the quantized version of it. We are going with the 1210 GGUF from Bloak. And on the right hand side, you can select from various quantization models. I have already selected the highest one, Q8, of around 7.7 .7 gig. In order to use it, just click on these three dots on the left, dismiss it, and then in the middle, select the model to load. And it will take some time to load if your system doesn't have much bandwidth then it might crash but let's see okay in my case it has loaded successfully let's drag this thing down a bit and now let's ask it the same question why lion is king of jungle and let's see let's wait for it to come back it will take time to come back because i'm not using beefy gpus okay let's print it out so you can see here it is producing quite a good response i think there are some issues with the response to like this random text maybe some hallucination or something but it's a quantized version so that is expected but as you saw in the full online hosted demo it was good but still i would say even in the quantized one the output is quite nice so I'll just stop generating from here and I'm going to ask it one of the forte of this, like the coding question. 
I'll say just type it here create a Python script to parse CSV file and extract only third column in uppercase let's see press enter let's wait for it to come back so there you go it has produced the script for us and it has also told us how to run it how to save it and from a quick glance the script looks okay to me i think because it is using upper function it is iterating through that csv file so all in all pretty good script spot on with all the commands and stuff so very impressed by the model and even this quantized version is quite impressive i would say now feel free to play around with it i'll drop the link to its um, quantized version and also the github repo here where you can uh, read the whole paper and paper is also quite good by the way and the hugging face page and this is the online demo which i showed you earlier so read through it pretty good read and there are also some benchmarks as you can see it has already beaten a lot of other uh, models including the Zephyr and Mistral which is quite amazing and this is a paper I was talking about which you can read through if you are in the mood of reading something uh, a bit thick so but uh, nicely written I have read the abstract seems quite good to me so this is it guys I hope that you enjoyed it if you have any questions or if you're stuck anywhere let me know or if you have experienced it already let me know your experience I'm very keen to learn and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel thank you very much